Okay, here I am uh, on the uh, promenade in Cove, uh, looking over uh, Cork Harbour, uh, which is looking particularly beautiful this evening as the sun goes down. Uh, but we're here to, uh, to kick off the uh, centenary uh, commemoration events uh, for uh, the sinking of the Lusitania, uh, which of course uh, happened just under 100 years ago now. Uh, on the 7th of May, uh, 1915, uh, the Lusitania, um, about 16 kilometers off the old Hedekin sail, was sunk by a torpedo from a German U-boat. Uh, and the significance of that event in terms of the First World War was just huge, because um, two years later, um, uh, that being a major contributing factor, uh, the US decided uh, to enter the war. Uh, but here in Cove uh, and in Cork Harbour, uh, there are um, uh, significant memories and stories from that time. There are um, 150 of the, uh, the people who lost their lives uh, um, during that tragedy are buried here in mass graves. Uh, and of course, um, the Lusitania, just like the Titanic a number of years ago, is very much part of the, the history and the stories of, uh, of Cove uh, and Cork Harbour. Uh, so this will be, uh, this evening will be the first of a whole series of events for the next four months. Uh, that remind people of the maritime history, the military history uh, and the significance of Cork Harbour and Cove uh, as part of that story. We're looking across at, at Hall Bolan Island uh, and Spike Island um, uh, where of course we have major plans for redevelopment and investment uh, to build uh, probably Ireland's biggest uh, marine tourism uh, project over the next uh, number of years. So there's a lot of a lot happening, um, but um, for the next number of months, the main focus in Cork Harbour will certainly be on Lusitania.